Welcome to Tech Brothers. In this video, we're going to answer a question, and the question is, what is the difference between cluster mode and standard mode of SQL Server installation? Well, when you install SQL Server, there, uh, as as the question uh, explained here, uh, there are two modes that you can install SQL Server. One is uh, standard mode, and other is cluster mode. Um, cluster is uh, actually using Windows uh, uh, Server clustering uh, feature and that's for high availability and that's a totally different uh, um, installation of uh, SQL Server. When you install SQL Server in standard mode, it's, it's just uh, the installation of that particular instance of SQL Server on a particular server. So if that server goes down, your SQL Server goes down with that. But in cluster, uh, since cluster uh, is there for high availability, if that particular, uh, if you install SQL Server in clustering mode, uh, what happened is as soon as the where you uh, your there there are nodes. So if SQL Server goes uh, the node uh, primary node uh, goes down, then SQL Server can switch to another node, and it's called failover. SQL Server services can fail over to the other node. So, in order to have that SQL Server, since SQL Server is cluster-aware service, so if you install SQL Server in clustering mode, it's a different installation, and that gives you high availability. Standard mode will not give you high availability. So that's the main difference. I hope it helps.